There are a number of different options that you have for creating your badges. If you were to simply search create digital badges for students for free, you would find a number of different options. For example, badgecert.com, www.makebadgebadg.es, there is an openbadges.me option. There is a badgelist.com option. And a popular one is Canva, C-A-N-V-A dot com. In addition, the Badger program that we use at Toro University also has the ability to design a badge, which gives you some options to create a basic badge that you can use to help gamify your course. One that I particularly like is this website, https colon forward slash forward slash badge dot design. And it's a site that doesn't have a login. And as you can see here, you have the option of a number of different background designs. You can add text into your a badge. You can upload images if you have ones that you would like to use as a part of the badge. There are a variety of different icons that you can incorporate into your badge as well as a number of different ribbons that you can use across or underneath or along the sides of your badge. In order to actually create the badge you would basically just go to the option that you would like to use so say we want to use this particular circle here. I just double click on it and you see it pops up over here. Now I have the ability to change the colors of that if I don't like the preset colors. You'll notice that it doesn't come quite as large as the square that's available there. So I'm just going to increase the size a little bit on the two corners so that it takes up the full space. Now I can put in some text here. And as you can see, um, I have the ability to change the font if I want it to be italics or underlined, the alignment, the size of it. In this case, I'm going to leave all of those the same and I'm just going to call this module one. And so here's the badge that I've created for module one. And when I'm ready to finish it, all I have to do is click on the download badge PNG button here in the top right hand corner and it will download it to my account so I'm going to add my Toro address here and click download and it should download it to my local computer